Hey everybody, Justin from FrugalSnobs.com. What's up YouTube? Brock Smith, say hello. Hello. Brought a quick drink review, a brew review, if you will, uh, to everybody. Everybody's been kind of digging their beer reviews on the channel here, so thank you for that. Hit the subscribe button while you're here if you haven't done so already. It helps us out. If you'd like to learn more about the Frugal Snobs podcast, check us out at FrugalSnobs.com. All the information you're going to need to hook up with the podcast is there. Cheap plugs out of the way? Good. Good. All right. So now that she plugs are out of the way, I am enjoying the Port City Brewing Oktoberfest. Yes. Seasonal. Yes. It is a seasonal 5.5% ABV, 24 IBU. Yes. And again, this is out of Alexandria, Virginia, right up the street, as we yes. like to say. So um, this is a Marzen Lager, M-A-R-Z-E-N, with umlaut. With yes. A. And basically it is a medium to full-bodied beer originating in Bavaria, specifically near Munich. So... Anything you want to say about this before I take a sniff? I was going to say, it's actually brewed with all German malts and Hallertal hops. Gotcha. Hmm. Fancy. Which, that's what actually gives it its color. I'm enjoying this out of a Sam Adams Perfect Pint. Now, Beer Advocate gave us a 3.8. 3.85. Oh, excuse me, a 3.85. So, I'm going to take a sniff here. And this should have, like, a malty flavor to it? It has a portery smell to it, folks. It's kind of a mix between a lager and a porter. I could smell this thing... Far from the glass, several inches above the glass. So you don't have to get close to smell it. Had no head on it when Christina poured it, poured properly. And just from the looks of it, folks, it's a medium brown to a, a darker brown color, almost like a mix again between a lager and a porter. It's going to take a taste. And with mm. how they actually brewed this, you're supposed to get a clean, dry finish. Which you do. Um, you definitely taste the 24 IBUs on the aftertaste. Four tastes is like a lager, aftertaste is like a porter. I mean, that's the way I can I can focus on it, folks. Is it's like a mix between a perfect blend of a lager and a porter. So if you like a lager and want something stronger, it might be for you. If you want, if you like porter and want something different than a porter, it might also be for you. If you're a session IPA person, it may also be for you. And a session IPA is any IPA that's, uh, I believe, under 5%. Uh, but don't quote me on that, folks. But uh, if you're a session IPA person, a porter person, or a lager person that wants something different, this might be for you. Um, I definitely enjoy it. Drink it very cold, folks. 40 to 45 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, you can enjoy it as a standalone. I probably wouldn't pair this really with any food other than maybe some pretzels, peanuts, something salty uh, and crunchy might be... Um, Tortilla chips? Possibly, but that might be too uh, salty. But I would say something that's bready, like pretzels, would probably be a really good fit for this. Or, again, peanuts or mixed nuts would be fine. I'd probably give this a four to four and a half star snob rating. So check it out, folks. It is the Port City Brewing Company's Oktoberfest. You'll find a number of Oktoberfests this time of year. Uh, but this is not too uh, too shabby, folks. Sports City Brewing's Oktoberfest from Alexandria, Virginia. Hope everybody enjoyed this review. Again, enjoy responsibly. As always, be well. Never pay retail. Take care of yourself and each other.